Do you know Anthony Weiner's favorite genre of music? How about Toronto Mayor Rob Ford? No? Well, that's odd because it seems extremely relevant to the cocaine-smoking, self-proclaimed alcoholic congressman from Florida, Trey Radel. A Tea Party darling and self-professed hip-hop congressman, he's also boasted of his love for rap music. All in all, a devastating day for the hip-hop-loving first-term conservative. Radel, who calls himself a hip-hop conservative. Congressman Trey Radel is the self-proclaimed hip-hop conservative. Tuesday, Republican Florida Congressman Trey Radel pleaded guilty to cocaine possession. I've let down our country. I've let down our constituents. I've let down my family. Which, rightfully so, plunged the congressman into the spotlight. But for some reason, his choice in music became a seemingly relevant tidbit of information. If you're wondering where all this hip-hop conservative stuff came from, well, there are a few places. One, his Twitter page, where he has hip-hop conservative written in his bio and he occasionally gives a rap recommendation or two. He also wrote a piece in BuzzFeed explaining his love for hip hop where he says in part, my love of hip hop never ceased and included the aforementioned Chuck D of Public Enemy. I find a conservative message and fight the power because I believe when government expands, it becomes a political tool meant to oppress. But the big question is, why does Congressman Rado's music choice matter? Well, we don't think it does. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrews.